Hello everyone, Susie Gaming here and welcome back to another War Thunder episode. In this video I'm gonna review two brand new vehicles, Object 122MT and Zerini 1. Starting with the object, it's a Chinese MBT BR of 8.3 and it's a squadron vehicle. If you still don't have a squadron you can join to mine via Discord and start grinding for this. Cost 400,000 squadron research points which equals to 60 days. It's basically upgraded T62, it's already worth researching it. Visually, especially from the back, it looks like a NATO tank. All of the empty spaces are covered up with these panels. Back, top and rear of the tank looks extremely clean, almost feels like a modernized tank. In addition, it got four ATGM pods, you cannot shoot them on the move. I have two and a half second reloading time. You should remember the missile launch order, otherwise you might hit the building. It goes like this, left, right, right, left. But this quad missile pod saves your life, literally. When you fire the cannon, the reloading time unfortunately is 12 seconds, that's why T-62 is not the best tank among the NATO competitors. But thanks to this quad missile pod, you receive a second chance after firing your main cannon. The missile damage is quite random, uh, so is the dart round we have, so not every target will be one-tapped. Survivability wise, of course, let's remember the old BMP-2M before it got nerfed. It was 8.7, it had quad missile as well, but it was suffering and still suffering from low survivability. It was popping like balloon. Uh, here it got eliminated for basically more armored uh, BMP. But unfortunately we cannot fire the ATGMs on the move. That's the big minus. We also have Dushka machine gun on top, uh, which is effective to kill non-armored targets. Another bad thing, we only have four missiles. They don't reload after you deplete them. Only inside the objective. And they reload quite fast actually inside the objective. Uh, so after you deplete your ATGMs, you're just a regular T-62. A clumsy slow turret rotation with the long reloading time. But yeah, visually it looks absolutely sick. I like this three-dimensional stars and I like the panel coverage that we have here. I'll say it's worth it. Like you're getting this for free anyways. So if you made a mistake by purchasing Chinese T69, uh, this is a good alternative if you want to back it up. Armor-wise, we're not efficient as Soviet Premium T55 AM1, but we're not a balloon as BMP either. This tank is efficient against low BRs, but being penetrated by everything frontally except autocannons. Next tank we have is the Italians Rene. The operator country is Hungary. It almost have this cursed Churchill gun carrier look. Frankenstein's monster. There's currently a summer event, as you know. And if you get the four stars, you get in this machine. It's a premium BR 4.0 Italian tank destroyer. It's basically a combination of Panzer Warfare and Stuck 3. What's impressive here, we actually have a quite thick hull for this BR. It is thick as turret mask of the Shermans. But still, you can easily kill it by shooting at the lower plate. However, this area is quite durable. A barrel mask, <laughs> it is ginormous. And it's exposed. Uh, these rockets we have are same as in Panzer Warfare. The rocket pads we have, they can go up and down. So if you're at the flat surface, you cannot hit the target in front of you. Uh, if you want to hit something, you need to angle your tank like this, bit down, and start firing. They cannot turn left and right. The fire order is right, left, right, left, right, left. Reloading time is not that long. But can be loaded in the objective. It leaks 10 mm more penetration from the Breda cannon. It's probably my favorite uh, Italian uh, vehicle to use at this BR. Before it would have been R3. God damn it. Devs just murdered this tank. So if you didn't start grinding Italian Tech 3, this thing will boost your process. If they hit the rocket pad, you'll die as well. It happened to me once. 
not a pleasant experience. 27 millimeter of uh, tration, 2 kilograms of explosive mass. And most of the time you're playing against Soviet heavy armor. Only recommended for collectors and for people that still didn't start researching Italian tech tree. You only need 4 event stars. You're gonna be able to get this premium tank destroyer. This tank also shines with its reverse speed. I'll appreciate if you press like button and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. I think the only thing I've killed in the real uh, here with the rocks. What? Oh, sure. Help! Fuck. Rocket! 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 He shot it! Ah! Out of the way! Out of the way! Yes! Well, I tell you not, I was trying to get out of the way, I drive forwards, he drives forwards, I drive backwards, he went backwards. Oh, oh that was epic as well, like, a little bit of tension. He <laughs> shot my rocket so I couldn't fight. Oh, shit. Well, we got the rocket. Kill. Yes, mission accomplished.